Born with a genetic eye disease, a North Carolina man knew from a young age he'd eventually lose his vision, and bit by bit it became more difficult to see, until he received a type of gene therapy at Duke that is changing his view. It's one of the most beautiful sights a parent can see, the face of their newborn baby. It is amazing. Amazing for Tyler Wilfong not just to become a dad, but to see his child in a way he once thought impossible. I have RP, which is called retinitis pigmentosis. I've had it since I was born. The genetic condition causes vision to deteriorate. It progresses to where it, it's pretty much blindness. I had my license up until I was 23, and then my peripheral vision got too bad. He relied on his wife even to walk through a store, and he knew the vision loss would keep getting worse. I knew it was inevitable, but... I kept my faith in God. He learned the Duke Eye Center offers a gene therapy that could change the course of his disease. There's a gene that is important for the retina to work properly, and a mutation in that gene renders it um, you know, not functional. And so uh, what we try to do is to bring a healthy copy of that gene into the eye through uh, an injection. Doctors use a virus to do that. This virus is specifically developed to infect the cells in the back part of the eye to really serve as a vehicle to deliver the new gene, a good gene. Tyler received the therapy on one eye in the spring, and within days he noticed something remarkable. I could actually see my fingers in front of my face, like, which I've never been able to do. He's scheduled for surgery on his other eye this fall, and while he doesn't know how much his vision will improve, he no longer fears losing all of his sight. That's a big sense of relief. Doctors are clear this therapy won't work for everyone. Problems with many different genes can cause vision loss. This applies to only those patients who have this particular gene affected. For the other about 100,000 Americans living with RP, uh, they're still waiting for their treatments. And so we really have our work cut out for us. Duke researchers are working on that and say this is just the beginning. It has only fueled really explosion in gene therapy research, not only for the eye, but all, also for all the other inherited um, diseases. For Tyler, the therapy came at the perfect time. He can now see well enough to care for his newborn son. It's made a, a world of difference. And he can't wait to watch his little boy grow. It's been a blessing. Must be such an amazing sight to see his little boy like that. Duke Eye Center is the only place in the Carolinas that offers this gene therapy.